prodigious performance at Augusta saw Tiger Woods become the first black man to win a golf major, and by a record margin. Eldrick Tiger Woods announced his arrival on the professional golf stage by winning the U.S. Masters in Augusta, aged just 21 years, on this day in 1997. Woods became the youngest man to win the title and the first black man to ever win a major, with a tournament record score of 278 shots under par. His winning margin was an incredible 12 strokes three more than the previous record, held by Jack Nicklaus. Woods had only turned professional in August 1996, not long after winning his third consecutive U.S. Amateur Championship. He had already attracted sponsorship and endorsements worth $60 million, such was his profile and the expectation around him. After a slow start and an unimpressive first nine holes, he pulled himself back into contention, and by the end of the second day's play, he was at the top of the leaderboard, a position he would not relinquish. Tiger Woods during his victorious final round. He soon tripled his lead from three to nine strokes on this Saturday, and though eventual runner up Tom Kite clawed back some of the deficit early on the final day, Woods was far enough ahead for his last round to largely be a procession. Speaking after receiving the coveted green jacket from previous winner Nick Faldo, the young champion said, I never thought I would have a lead like I did, you envisioned dueling it out with Nicholas or Watson or Faldo, but never to do it in the fashion I did. Dot former champion and record holder Nicholas could only marvel at Wood's abilities. He's more dominant over the guys he's playing against than I ever was over the ones I played against, said the 18-time major winner. He's so long, he reduces the course to nothing. Absolutely nothing.